So, this is the other one uh, that I said I would do the unboxing for uh, on the other one uh, from Brightstar. But this is by um, TNT Fireworks. So, let's open it up and see what is inside. And watch, watch me slip my fingers up, and it'd be funny. Would it be the first time, eh? Uh, don't want to fucking tear anything, do we now? Yeah. So, we get a Catherine wheel. And we get... Four of the little fountains, and they are actually quite good. Actually, you get them in most TNA um, selection boxes, and then you have the um, can't pronounce the name of that, but let's just class it as a Mexican one because it's got a Mexican hat on it, that and that so actually nice. does look nice. And then we also have the Magic Comet which is also a fountain. And then we have Volcano. And you get another one of them, a Volcano. And then we also get Carnival, which is also another um, fountain. And whatever that is, I'm not really good at pronouncing names, but I presume if we look on here, it is also a fountain as well. Just for purpose of reference, this is a TNT Asteroid. A nice little fountain, is that one actually? And we also get a Fireball Roman Candle 5 shot. Hmm. And you also get um, another one. A 5 shot Roman Candle. And then Crackling and Sparkling Fountain. And then we also get a Northern Light, which is also another fountain. And you also get a Party Time Six Shot Cake. I'd say that's probably one of the best ones that's actually within the whole of this. But I'll say, if you are getting them and you're getting buy one, get one free. I mean, I got this one for 20 quid as alongside as the other one that I did with Brightstar. and unboxed that. I think it was a monster one. But they're the shot tubes in there. I mean, they're not... I think that's just over-packaged, in my opinion, to be completely fair with you. But for, it says... It doesn't really give you much information on what it actually does, but it'd be interesting to see what it does do. So when it does, and we set that off, we will let you guys know exactly what it is. But the question is, would I recommend this to um, families? Yeah, um, especially if kids don't like fireworks. I mean, you also get one of them, and you also, and we miss one out, uh, we get the laser shower. Um, so... Yeah, I mean, if you're getting two for 20 quid and they buy one, get one free, then yeah, I'd say it's a great little pack, that, for kids. Uh, especially if they're not liking fireworks. I think probably the only one that would probably make the most noise is that one. Uh, but I say we did get some of these from the Asda as well. As you can tell, I have set one already off because somebody was showing off on my street earlier, so I thought I would decide to shit them all up. But they are quite good as well in themselves. And I also got um, some of them as well, uh, Thunder uh, Rockets. I actually got two packs of them, and they were uh, buy one, get one free. So, not bad for your money, you know, especially if you can get buy one, get one free. The other ones that of them are in the bedroom, uh, but they're due to go down to my mum's, because they're not mine, they're my aunties are the other ones. Uh, but yeah, definitely recommend it to kid, uh, to uh, a small family. Um, and I will try and do an unboxing of the Bonfire Night version 1. Um, and as always guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.